Ladies and gentlemen, the Megapixel race is back on. I present to you the Canon EOS 5DS and 5DSR with a 50.6 megapixel full frame CMOS sensor. So if you were thinking to move to medium format just to get that extra boost in resolution, this might be a camera to keep you on the 35mm side. Apart from the crazy resolution sensor, the 5DS and 5DSR share two digit six processors, which allow the camera to shoot at speeds of up to five frames a second. There is a 61 point AF system inside and a redesigned mirror vibration control system. So the mirror has been redesigned entirely to reduce the effects of mirror vibration on your final image. There is a 3.2 inch LCD screen at the back and the cameras also come with dual card slots, both CF and SD. If 50.6 megapixels is just way too much resolution for you, you have three in-camera crop shooting modes. So the first is the full crop, then you can move down to your APS-H 1.2 three times crop and then down to your APS-C 1.6 times crop and also in the viewfinder when you're shooting on um, these three modes you will actually see the viewfinder show you the total area that you'll be capturing so if you're at a 1.3 or 1.6 times crop the viewfinder will actually have a blacked out area showing you the parts of the image that are not being captured. The 5DS and the 5DSR are designed primarily for stills photographers, so while you get all the bells and whistles of cameras like the 5D Mark III in terms of all your movie shooting features, you don't get a headphone out port and you also don't get uncompressed HDMI out for recording purposes. The Canon 5DS and 5DSR will be available globally in June with pricing released closer to the date. For more information, check out CNET.com.